University of Idaho holding its winter graduation this weekend, but overshadowing the ceremony is the search for the suspect in the brutal murders of four students almost exactly a month ago. As police look for a break in the case, they're now asking for help in locating a car that was near the victim's off-campus home around the time of the murders. Alexis McAdams is in Moscow, Idaho with the latest. It's been nearly one month since the murders and still no arrest in the case. And now investigators are reminding the public to be vigilant this weekend because there are a lot of families in town for winter graduation. Take a look here. This is from that graduation ceremony at the University of Idaho where they held a moment of silence for the four students who lost their lives. You can see the graduates filling in as the mood on the campus remains somber. It's been a tough few weeks for our community. And I want to acknowledge an enormous loss in our Vandal family recently. Ethan Chapin, Zana Kernodal, Maddie Mogan, and Kaylee Consalvis were taken from us far too soon by a senseless act of violence. They were bright lights on our campus and cherished members of our community. Sunday marks one month since Zana Kernodal, Maddie Mogan, Kaylee Gonsalves, and Ethan Chapin were murdered. Kaylee was set to graduate this weekend, now her family grieving as police continue to search for the killer. This case is not going cold. We have tips coming in. We have investigators out every day interviewing people. We're still reviewing evidence. We're still looking at um, all aspects of this. And I said early on that um, no stone will go unturned. Now police are looking to track down this white Hyundai Elantra. These are stock photos or examples, but investigators tell us it's a 2011 to 2013 model. It was spotted right near the home around the time of the murders, and police believe the person or people inside could have vital information about the case. They still have tip lines open here in Moscow, Idaho, and are hoping someone will call and give them the information they need to crack this case. Reporting in Moscow, Idaho, I'm Alexis McAdams, Fox News.